guys, welcome back to Isaac Tube HD. Isaac here with a brand new video for you guys today. So today, it's gonna be a lot. So the Lego set I do have is a Lego Cities Big Wheels gift set. It is set 66772 and it is ages five and up with 330 pieces. It does come with the farmer, farmer garden and scarecrow set with a construction figure and the tractor set. As you guys can tell, it does come with five figures and it does come with one, three sets. One to three sets. Um, it's pretty cool. Um, this is the back of it. Literally, the poly bag is just a bonus because it's supposed to be two boxes only. So it's pretty much a lot. Like it's it's a lot. So uh, it looks amazing. I like the figures. And I like the tractors. They look pretty big on my end, but for a pretty big box, they they'll like they'll look smaller. So it's a two in one pack combo, and um, I do have a timeless video for this. And I'm just gonna see you guys right after that. So let's get building. Alrighty guys, so we are back from the time lapse and we have everything here which is super freaking cute. Um, it is so amazing. I do love it. Um, we're going to start off with the figures first. The first figure we do have is the rabbit. She is such an adorable little rabbit. Um, I do like her. It's pretty much cute. It's cute enough. It's cute enough. I don't know if you guys can see that, but yeah, it's cute. My, I already have, a, like, a bunch of these, so it's, like, a bunch of rabbits, so pretty much. The next figure we're going to start off with next is this little farmer girl. She is super cute. She, she not, she's not a, she's not a double-sided face. Um, I do love the torso between the front and the back, so that is technically what she looks like. She is adorable. I do love her. The overall on her is just, like, where did these clothes even come from? Like, the designs, the ideas, you know? The next figure we're going to start off with is the Farmer Father, I believe. I believe it's her father. He looks like one of the Star Wars characters, but I do like the overalls with the printing along with the back printing. This guy is not a double-sided face. Oh, he is. I forgot. LOL. But this is his back face of what he looks like. Um, and then the front face, you guys already seen that. So yeah, the printing on his torso kind of looks like one of the Jedi characters. It's similar to the Apple, the like Apple ones I've been using for like my designs of Applebee's, like you know the the branding ish. But um, yeah, it's kind of similar, but I do like it. So yeah, the next up we have a construction worker girl. She is pretty amazing. I love her printings on the torso and the face. She is just a cool character. I love the hat and hair. Kind of like symbolize like a girl, female, male thing. In the back of her printing, she does have, like, a little walkie-talkie to, like, you know, guide other people. So, pretty much, yeah, it's pretty much good. I like it. We do have a similar figure to that, but this one's with, you know, grip black navy blue jeans. Um, he is, like, the partner in crime to construction. This guy is super cool. The face looks so familiar. I feel like I have him already. The hat is not with the hair, but the back torso is kind of the same. I do enjoy it, so pretty much it's like a good thing. But yeah, the last figure we do have is this farm, like, 
another guy in overalls, but this one's like for farming plants, kind of like dairy stuff. This guy is super cool. Um, he's just an amazing character, honestly. I don't know if you guys can see that right there. So I'm kind of blocking with my whole finger, but pretty much it looks pretty cool. Um, the, the printing in the middle kind of represents a different branding. The back torso, it's, it's all right. It's just the overall itself. So pretty much, um, I don't know. It's pretty weird. It looks familiar. Like this brand, it's like used for like dairy products, etc., etc. But yeah, and then moving on, this water teapot it comes with as well. This is a cool one of the accessories I do have. It's now cute. Um, it's pretty cool. I like it. I don't know if you guys can see that. But yeah, it's pretty cool. It's like a watering plant, so I pretty much like it. The next thing we do have is these little, little, like, grass hay bells. Um, they're like a pretty little, like, thing. So it's like, I'm going to use that for the farm, for my sister's farm. So pretty much. And then we do have the scarecrow guy. Like, this is the planting with the scarecrow. It looks cute. It looks awesome. It looks like an actual, like, Farmville kind of thing. So, it's an amazing. It's not printed face, but it does come with the hat and the pitchfork. The next one we do have is this little charger station. It's like a satellite kind of like dish kind of thing. So, it's a solar panel with electronic charger with two seats. Um, it is usable. And... Pretty much, it, it's like people use that with on the bus or something, or like, I don't know. So yeah, the next one we have is kind of basic. It's the dig site for one of the construction, like the construction digger. Um, it just would, you just like press it, but like it's like a plank. So it's what it looks like on the inside between. Can you guys see me? Can you guys see me? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, the printing is cool on the wooden boards. I might use it for a figure, but overall it's good. I like it. The other accessories that we do have is two crates and a bunch of fruits. I used this little plant for one of the carrots because it look, kind of looked really more realistic than the other ones did. We also come with a pumpkin and a red apple. So pretty much two crates, second crates full of nothing, top crates full of all the fruits and vegetables. But yeah, no, not my apple. Yeah, not my apple. But yeah, that is, you know, that, the small parts. Now we're going to get into the big parts. We do have, I believe, a construction digger. Um, this one has a weird, like, other piece to it. It does have the digger piece. I don't know if they use this in construction, but they use this for, like, digging and stuff. But I don't know why they have this for. I think it's to, like, lift stuff up, but it's kind of one of those. But, you know, it's two pieces. It does move. It does work. You can move it, like, you know, norm naturally. Um... You're able to move this back side. It's like a little drill thing, so it's kind of like movable. So, yeah, it's not that bad, especially especially in the ending too. So like triangle, you could even go like farther, like like a scorpion kind of like a thing. This looks pretty good. I like kind of actually kind of like this one. It's like a zapper, but overall, it's not what it is used for. It is a digging item. This con um, construction digger does carry two accessories: um, a shovel and a broom. So pretty much it's pretty cool. I like it. It's pretty small. The top is easily removable. Um, you just gotta like remove it and you're like, you have to take it apart to be able to add the figures inside it. But it looks good. I like it. Um, the next one we do have is a tractor. I have not seen these in real life. I've seen if of it, iffy of it. But it does come with the big old window thing with like lights, the little siren thing, like the lights. The little pipe thing that the gas goes through makes, like, cloud smoke. It's kind of the same thing, kind of like the construction digger, just same piece. We have two of these, though. Um, it's pretty much movable. You're able to remove the top part to easily add a figure inside, pretty much as so. Um, it looks it looks like it's needed more of an addition to certain things, but overall, I like it. And the crazy about this set, the 66772 set... It had boxes inside as well, so it had the exact, like, set in it, the tractor, it even had the poly bag in it, like, I was just so intrigued, and when I opened it for the time lapse video, like, I just opened it, and, like, everything was in it, so I was like, whoa, like, there's, there's no such thing as a Lego box and a Lego box, like, that's the most, like, that would have been a good idea for, like, a gift, but, um, overall, I do like it, it's amazing, I cannot believe this came about, but I like it overall. 
But um, I'm going to go ahead and end the video for today, you guys. I want to thank you all so much for coming on today's video. This video was so amazing to make. And I enjoyed it as well because of the figures, animals, accessories, etc. But yeah, if you are brand new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button with the bell notifications. And to get notified on every video I make. Basically, every week in a row. Um, I will be posting random videos probably like through Friday through Monday, Tuesday. But Wednesdays and Thursdays are usually like my go-to making of the video. Um, but it depends. Like, will I either make the video or will I not make the video? But overall, it is amazing. So, if you're already subscribed to the channel, don't forget to click the like, comment, share button. to all friends and family, whoever loves Legos. Or Legos and Jago sets in general. I mean, I haven't done a Ninjago set in a long time. But we are close to that goal on getting those Lego sets. But as soon as I get them, we'll review them. But yeah, I want to thank you guys so much again for coming on for today's video. And stay tuned for the future videos. Peace out.